now, welcome inside studio. A call to the bullpen is made, and it looks like we'll be seeing a double-A debut here in relief. And that one fouled off. Foul ball still 0-2. strikeout her first strikeout in double a and that is definitely the now type of stuff that Catcher. can keep you moving okay. up the ladder to the bigs Porter. she's two outs away logan porter digs in now swing and a foul straight back to short tosses across to first they are down to their final out the batter number eight second baseman and now it's the switch hitting second baseman and swing and miss some serious velocity coming out of the pen clearly foul ball there Two outs in the bottom of the ninth, and it's a two-run game. Right through there for the strikeout, and that'll do it. She records her very first save in professional baseball, and I have a feeling there are a lot more of those to come. Fans are final line score. First for the Victoria. Oh, welcome back. Thrilled to be with you.
those of you joining us now, Ben Gelman here bringing you the action. Late stages of this one, nobody out in the ninth inning. Professor. Ramirez, the leadoff batter, cuts and misses for strike one. Swing and a foul back, that's out of play. 0-2, oh, rocks and fires. Just miss. Nice take. One and two, here's the pitch. Pops this one up. Gets under it. Pulls it in, and there's one away. Here's the second baseman, Mia Lewis. That one finds the zone. One down. Base is empty here in the ninth. Swings through it. Some serious velocity coming out of the pen, clearly. Fights that one away. The count remains 0 and 2. Lifted down the left side. Makes the grab for the second out. So it's their last chance of the ball game. The third baseman, number 98, will hit next. He swings and fouls one off. Just a hair behind on that fastball. He's got to get the swing going earlier. Fly to center, and that ought to do it. That is the ball game. Fans are final line score. First for the victorious Bruins. Welcome to those of you joining us now. Ben Gelman here bringing you the action. Late stages of this one. Nobody out in the ninth inning. Now it's the second baseman, Mia Lewis. First pitch, and it just misses. Professor measures five feet, seven inches. She works with a four-seam fastball, a cutter, a sinker, a splitter, and she mixes in a slider. She swings and fouls one off. Late on that fastball. On a cold night like this, hitters are trying to get out in front so they don't get jammed. A pitcher can counter that by using the off-speed stuff more frequently. Two, two. Battling here, fouls it away. Two and two, here's the pitch. Goes down looking on that one. And she must have been looking in some other location. Otherwise, I don't know why she'd go down looking on a fastball on the inner half. Lovely. Late swing, fouled it off. One down. Base is empty here in the ninth. Strike two. That one 95 to finish the punch out. So down to their final out of this one. The left fielder, number 12, the next to hit. Some serious heat, 97 on that fastball. Two down and nobody aboard. You're in the top of the ninth. Win. Tally three punch outs and earn the save. That was a really strong performance out of the pen. Attacked hitters and didn't beat herself.
Back now on MLB Network from Studio. To those of you joining us now, Ben now, Gelman here bringing you the action. Late Number stages 16. of this one, nobody out in the ninth uh, inning. Three, four, five hitters due up for the home squad. Digging in, the first baseman, the number first 29. Baseman. That one fouled off. Sub-auto. Hey now, hey now. And the 0-1 net. Now a tapper that rolls foul. 0-2 now. It's ball one. One ball, two strikes. Got it. That's the first out. Next up, the shortstop, number seven. And a good fastball to start off. That's strike one. Not a great showing from their offense so far. One of these hitters has to find a way to spark something and get them some runs. And goes down looking. So down to their final out of this one. Now at the dish, Ernie Yee. Swing and a foul straight back. Swing and a miss. Some serious velocity coming out of the pen, clearly. Got it. And that's the ball game. Professor, with a fantastic bit of relief work in the win, didn't allow any runs and got the save. Love to see relievers come out and shut things down the way she did in this one. Definitely a nice piece. Welcome to those of you joining us now. Ben Gelman here bringing you the action. Late stages of this one. Nobody out in the ninth inning. Here's the catcher. Some serious heat. 97 on that fastball. Splits the middle. That's a strike. And it's 0-2. One run game in the bottom of the ninth. Swings through it, and that's a K. And now the right fielder. Now batting, right fielder. Come Rosario. And there's a strike. When she enters the game, hitters know they'll have to deal with that excellent velocity. Even with it being more common for pitchers to throw hard nowadays, it's still very impressive. Dive, got it, in time, out. I can't say enough about the effort on this play. He dove to keep the ball from getting past him and recognized he had to get a throw off quick. So he lets it loose from his knees and gets the out. So 
it's their last chance of the ball game. The third baseman, number one, now at the plate. And that one fouled off. Hoping to put the tying run aboard. That one finds the zone, and it's nothing in two. We'll see how well the field holds up with the way the rain is coming down. Drainage is a problem with some playing surface. Three. Strike three. That's the ball game. Professor had a strong showing in relief in the win. Pitched a clean inning for the save. That was a really strong performance out of the pen. Of you joining us now, Ben Gelman here bringing you the action. Late stages of this one, nobody out in the ninth inning. The second baseman now at the plate. Swing and a miss, late cut there. One strike. Cut on and missed. Oh, and two. That sinking fastball looks really hittable out of the hand, but the late movement just makes it dive under the bat. He goes down looking. She's two outs away. Digging in, the right fielder, number 16. Swing and a miss, strike one. One down, base is empty here in the ninth. Next pitch, in for a strike. And that just misses. Wow, he's showing an excellent eye at the plate. Really tough pitch to take. Gets it by him for the strikeout. So down to their final out of this one. And now the DH, Diego Hernandez. Swings and pulls it foul to the right side. The Naturals down to their last strike. Swings and misses, and that's the ball game. Professor with a fantastic bit of relief work in the win. Struck out all three batters face for the save. Lockdown relief out of the pen, exactly what they're counting on her to deliver. Nice job. Welcome to those of you joining us now. Ben Gelman here bringing you the action. Late stages of this one. Nobody out in the ninth inning. And that one fouled off. Hoping to put the tying run aboard. Some serious heat. 97 on that fastball. She came out of the bullpen looking sharp. Three pitch strikeout really sets a tone, and the opposing lineup is going to have a hard time keeping her from the save. She's two outs away. And here's the catcher, Tyler Cropley. And a big swing and a miss. No ball. One strike. Strike two. That's a hittable pitch, but not what he was looking for. Early in the count, it's okay to take that. That's Miss off the plate. It's a ball and two strikes. Got the strikeout. They are down to their final out. And this is the kind of work the manager was hoping for, calling her out of the bullpen to start this in. Those two straight K's really build confidence for the whole team that they can hold this lead. It's their last chance of the ball game. Here's the shortstop at the plate. Number three. That one finds the zone. Professor, just 21 years old, and she was drafted in the fourth round in 2023. Get in the 
base, right here. Professor is just one strike away. Ground ball, right side. Steps on the bag, ball game. Professor was outstanding in relief, helping them get the win. Didn't allow any runs and got the save. Love to see relievers come out and yeah, shut yeah, things yeah. down the way she did in this First one. Definitely a nice. Those of you joining us now, Ben Gelman here bringing you the action. Late stages of this one, nobody out in the ninth inning. Jose for me, getting ready to hit. This one is in there, and that's strike one. No ball, one strike. That one fouled off. Here's the 0 2 pitch. Battling here, fouls it away. 0-2, oh and, and the delivery. One, Slider two. misses away. You gotta get this guy. Tackle. Punches that one away with two strikes. And the one two. And a swing and a miss. And a strikeout. That's out number one here in the ninth. Now the left She's field. two outs away. The left fielder the digs in now. And that one fouled off. out and this is the kind of work the manager was hoping for calling her out of the bullpen to start this in those two straight K's really build confidence for the whole team that they can hold this lead the first baseman the batter now whips for strike one swing and a foul back that's out of play the Cardinals down to their last strike and that one is foul. We'll try again. Two outs. Let's get out of here. Two outs and nobody aboard. Bites that one away. The count remains 0 and 2. Got it. And that'll do it. Professor, with an excellent effort in relief en route to the win, pitched a clean inning for the save. Love to see relievers come out Fantastic. and shut things you. down the way she did in this one. Definitely. Uh, welcome to those of you just joining us. We're in the eighth inning with two outs. I'm Ben Gelman. So two down. The designated hitter will hit next. Swings and misses. Oh and one. Professor, just 21 years old. And she was drafted in the fourth round in 2023. Swing and a miss. And that's that. They get two runs on three hits, no errors, and one left. We head to We're back here at the ballpark. We go to the ninth, and here's the catcher, number 79. That one finds the zone, and it's 0-1. Her slider is absolutely hissing on its way home. 91 miles per hour. Pretty impressive. And here's the 0-2. And no, the pitch is outside, ball hey, one. Going down here. Swings and misses, struck him out. The third baseman, number three. And now at the plate, the third baseman, number three. That one in for a strike. It's 0-1. Strike 
No, nice eye right there. What a take with two strikes. Four. Gets it by him for the strikeout. So down to their final out of this one. And now the shortstop, Jose Fermin. He swings and fouls one off. Pitch no. misses there. And now it's even one and one. One ball, one strike. They're down to their final strike of the game. That's an outstanding splitter she features. When she tunnels it with her fastball like that, it puts batters in conflict, and that gives the edge to the pitcher. The Cardinals, down to their last strike. Right through there for the strikeout. And that'll do it.
This crowd is a buzz. They know they're about to witness history on the mound. Number 14, Anna. Foul ball there. Check that zone. Here comes the 0-1. And that one is in for a strike. Oh, and two, here's the pitch. Swings through it, and that's a K. Now batting. Now the third baseman, Zach DeZenzo. DeZenzo. Gets the slider in there for a strike. In the air to the right, moves under it. Brings it in. So down to their final out of this one. Now at the dish, Gray Kessinger. And that one fouled off. That's the modern day reliever. Serious zip on the fastball. Sky to left, and this should do it. That's the ball game. It's not every day you get to witness baseball history in action. Congratulations to her on her very first Triple A save. Our final line score, first for the big two. Welcome to those of you joining us Your now. Ben Gelman please. here bringing you the action. Late stages of this one. Nobody out Number in the ninth 14. inning. Anna. The right field. The batter now whiffs for strike Anna. one. And here's the 0-2. Fouls it back with two strikes. Hey, place it first, place it first. Swings and misses, goes down on strikes. One away. Now back, the designated hitter, David Hensley. David Hensley getting ready to hit. 0 for 3 with three ground outs. And there's a breaking ball that drops in. Professor, just 21 years old, and she was drafted in the fourth round in 2023. And a strike on the outside corner. When she enters the game, hitters know they'll have to deal with that excellent velocity. Even with it being more common for pitchers to throw hard nowadays, it's still very impressive. And this is the kind of work the manager was hoping for, calling her out of the bullpen to start this inning. Those two straight pays really build confidence for the whole team that they can hold this lead. It's a comebacker to the mound. And that's the ball game. Professor, with an excellent effort and relief en route to the win, pitched a clean inning for the save. That was a really strong performance out of the pen. Attacked hitters now and didn't beat herself. Nice job to usher them.
you joining us now. Ben Gelman here bringing you the action. Late stages of this one. Nobody out in the ninth inning. And now the right fielder. Professor. And that's through there for a strike. Pitch misses inside. And that's ball one. Next one's fouled back. Got no one. He goes down looking. Next up, the designated hitter. Foul ball there. One out and the base is empty. Rounder up the middle. Fires to first on the run. No, Not in time. He legs it out. Couldn't get the out, but what a defensive effort. Covered a ton of ground and then made a strong throw to make the play a little closer. The second baseman. The batter now whiffs for strike one. Now here's the 0-2. That one just misses. Wow, he's showing an excellent eye at the plate. Really tough pitch to take. Swings through it, and that's a K. So hard to hit a well-executed fastball in that location. No shame in fanning on that pitch. Swing and a drive, deep left field, pretty far back there. That one is gone. It just got out of here. It's 8-0. It's been a long time coming, but he finally breaks out of the power drought and pokes his first dinger of the season. That's got to be a relief for him. Three. Goes down looking on that one. So they get two... Professor was knocked around out of the pen in this one. Had a rough time in this one. Certainly a struggle. I'm sure. A meteoric rise. Come in, John Chambi, Chris now, Singleton. Late stages of this one. Nobody one out in the ninth. Well, one run game. So in now for Cleveland, Jackson Chorio. Fought off foul. Trying to keep good speed off the bases. Swings and misses. And it's 0-2. And, and a swing and a miss. And a strikeout for the first out here in the ninth. Well, that right there is what you want to see out of your closer. Come in and close the door. Cancel any hope that that opponent has in making some type of comeback in the ball game. Tell you what, that helps him settle in, and that helps everybody else relax a little bit to get these other two outs. Gets a piece and stays alive. Looking to get the tying run on base. Swings through it, and that's a strikeout. This is definitely what a team likes to see out of their closer. Come in and just destroy all home. First two batters, two strikeouts. See if he can strike out the side. So they're down to their final out. Francisco Alvarez digs in for the Guardians. There's a strike. One run game here at the top of the ninth. Next offering is in for a strike. the ball game well they win the opener at home first game of the three game series and there's just such a good feeling when you're in your own ballpark you're sleeping in your own bed you're eating your thoughts and there's food
them in. John Chambi, Chris Singleton. Late stages of this one. Nobody out in the ninth. Well, one run game. And now the DH, Matt Daly. That one finds the zone. And it's 0 1. 0 1. Up the middle. And that one finds its way through. And the tying run is on with a leadoff single. Always feels amazing getting a job done when the team needs you to come through. It's just bigger than your own individual stats. Just kept it simple. Played pepper with the middle of the infield and took it back where it came from. And there's just no one there to knock it down. The 0-2. Picks and misses. It's a strikeout. He came out of his mechanics there. Typically he likes to shoot the ball the other way. But that time, a little anxious. Now it's the second baseman, Luis Rangifo. Fought off foul. They hope he's the guy to spark a comeback. He tends to play better when his team is behind, so why not him? 2 now. That ball is foul and the pressure is building. Crowd locked in right now. One run game here in the ninth. Foul ball still 0-2. Got it! Now only one out remaining. Well, interesting. He's looking very comfortable out of the stretch after giving up the leadoff single. Back to back strikeout. So they haven't been able to move that runner up, get him into scoring position, and try to have a better chance of scoring. I tell you, good job so far on the mound. He just needs one more out. Reds down to their final out. Now it's going to be Brian. And he hits a ground ball right side. Steps on the bag himself. Ball game. After four wins in a row, you start to think a little bit that you're on a roll. And that's the momentum that just takes on a life of its own. Players start hitting up and down the lineup. You never know who's going to come up with If you just joined us, John Shambi and Chris Singleton as we've got two away in the ninth. Mitchell Ferris stands in now for the Diamondbacks. He's already homered in this game. And first offering is fouled off. And the pitch. Strike two. Two runs across in the inning. You're in game one of this three-game set. Oh, and a swing oh, and a miss. Oh. And that is the ball game. The final line score for our ball game tonight for the victorious Atlanta. Singleton. I'm John Shambi. Thanks for tuning in. And we've got a good one going here in extra innings. Well, one run game. Now, Mac Horvat. Fastball for a strike. 1 1. Well, comfortable or not, these are the situations closers they seem to live for. I mean, you get into some hot water, a gym, tough spot, whatever you want to call it. But this is where they earn their keep. Swing and a miss struck him out. Gassed it right by him. Well, the first batter, it's always a big one for the closer. I mean, you get that punch out, you get settled in, you feel like you're in command out there on the mound from the jump, and kind of prevents any doubt from creeping into your mind or the fielders that are playing behind you that, you know, you're going to wrap this thing up.
tried to check his swing. Appeal to third. Yes, he did. Down he goes on strikes. So it's their last chance in this one. And next for L.A., Cole Young. Yeehaw. And immediately pumps in a strike to the left-handed hitter. Well, if he's going to do something special right here, it's going to have to happen with two strikes. Swings and misses. Struck him out. And that ends the ball game. The tying run left stranded at second. Our final one. Man, John Chambi, Chris Singleton, late stages of this one. Nobody out in the night. Lars Nukbar up now for the Brewers. The right fielder. Lars. And a foul ball. He's a bad ball hitter, so even if you get him to chase pitches outside the zone, he still might beat you. Not an easy out by any means. And the right hander deals. Hits and misses. It's a strikeout. With that kind of velocity and elevated fastball, even if it's still in the strike zone, can be tough for hitters to get on top of. Popped up to the left, into foul ground, drifts towards it, squeezes it. That's out number two. That was a good pitch to hit right down the heart of the plate. Had pretty good timing on it, just got underneath it a little bit and popped it up. Two outs, base is empty. Next for the Brewers, Matt Olson. With this kind of lead, he can swing freely, try to hit the ball out of the park, do what he loves to do. And first offering is fouled off. And a big swing and a miss. Quickly in an 0-2 count, you've got to figure out a way to shorten your path to the baseball. Put it in place somewhere, then you got a chance. Two down, nobody on. And down on strikes. And a nice inning of work there as he sets him down. One, two, three. This is a huge win to take this series on the road before heading back home. You go home feeling good about yourselves. You've got some good moments. Welcome in, John Chambi, Chris Singleton. Late stages of this one. Nobody out in the ninth. And now the center fielder, Jack Sawinski. That one catches the zone. Going along. Looking to get the tying run on base. Gets a piece, and it stays 0-2. Right-hander kicks, deals. Sharp grounder, that's through for a base hit. I'd say a mistake pitch in an 0-2 count. Too good of a pitch to hit right there. You have to expand the zone. Keep that leadoff man off first base. Here's the third baseman, Cam Collier. Into center. And out number one on the ground. He's two outs away. Max Anderson, the next pirate to hit. Right through there for a strike. If you're a base runner, you've got to stay dialed in here. Look for anything in the dirt. Try your best to get in the scoring position. With two strikes, may see some movement over there at first base. Trying to stay out of the double play right here. The 0-2. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. 
Came inside with that two-strike fastball nicely and just punched him up on the inside part of the plate. Couldn't get around on it and catch it out front. Many times if you do, it's a foul ball. And you know a lot of pitchers, they really don't like working inside with two strikes because they do not want to hit that batter. And foul back our way, and that's out of play. The pitch. And that one fouled off. You want a guy that battles at the plate in the biggest moments of the game, and that's what they have right now. He didn't have the lead. He kept things steady, and he's rewarded with the W. Welcome in, John Chambi, Chris Singleton. Late stages of this one. Nobody out in the ninth. Well, one run game. Now, here is Brendan Donovan. Bounding ball here, rolls foul. Looking to get the tying run on base. Swing a foul over the screen and back out of play. Got him looking. That's a strikeout. Well, that right there is what you want to see out of your closer. Come in and close the door. Cancel any hope that that opponent has in making some type of comeback in the ball game. Tell you what, that helps him settle in, and that helps everybody else relax a little bit to get these other two outs. Late that time, and it's strike two. In the air, right field, on the move. Got it! Really had to move for that grab. And there's two away. So they're down to their final out. O'Neill Cruz, the next pirate to hit. Down the middle for a strike. Going along. Big Daddy, 25 years old, and he was a third round pick in 2023. This could end it. On the ground. And that one finds its way through. Joey gets on base and keeps it going. That's tremendous fight from him, and I know it's got the dugout fired up down there. Slap the other way. Foul. Two outs. Hard hit, right side. On the first, ball game. And the Braves hold on to win a tight one as this one ends as a one-run ball game. Another solid outing from him out of the bullpen. He's up to double digits now with his 10th save of the season. Welcome in, John Chambi, Chris Singleton. Late stages of this one. Nobody out in the ninth. Here's the Pirates catcher now. Swing and a miss at 100 miles an hour. Fouled off. He was late. The 0-2. Gets a piece there. We'll do it again. Wow, he got away with a mistake right there. Righty to the plate. Oh, that one, one just misses. And the count is 1-2. and two. Right Goes here. down looking. Well, the first batter, it's always a big one for the closer. I mean, you get that punch out, you get settled in, you feel like you're in command out there on the mound from the jump, and kind of prevents any doubt from creeping into your mind or the fielders that are playing behind you that, you know, you're going to wrap this thing up. Swing and a miss, blew it by him at 99. Caught him looking for the K. Well, it's kind of tough right here. Closer comes in and he strikes out the first two hitters. It's hard not to feel defeated and that this is going to go quickly. But you got to go up there, maybe try to find a way to choke up on the bat, spread out, put the ball in play, and maybe you can extend this inning. Last chance now for the Pirates. Next to hit, Brendan Donovan. Foul ball there. The Braves leading by two here in the finale of this four-game set. Is the ball game. These players just want to keep it rolling right now. You win this series, you got another team coming in, and you want to do exactly the same. Maybe even push a little further. Come in, John Chambi, Chris now, Singleton. Late Atlanta. stages of this Number one. 11. Nobody out in the ninth. So Where now the go? DH spot. Let's Avalon. The designated hitter. 
slant. There's a strike. Big Daddy, a former All-Star. He features a four-seam fastball, a cutter, and he works in a slider. Albies over to first in time. One up, one down. And now the right fielder, Lars Nukbar. And there's a strike. Good heater at 98. He's a bad ball hitter, so even if you get him to chase pitches outside the zone, he still might beat you. Not an easy out by any means. Makes the grab. Two down. Couple of pitches and a quick out. So it's their last chance in this one. Arjun Nimmel. And a foul ball. Two-run game with two away here in the bottom of the ninth. And a foul ball. Big Daddy is just one strike away. And a swing and a miss, and that is the ball game. Our final line score, first for the big... Come in, John Chambi, Chris now Singleton. Late play. stages of this one. Nobody, Nobody out in the ninth. Now it's the right fielder, Wilfredo Antunes. The right fielder, one four. for three. Wilfredo. A swing and a miss, and that's strike one. Big Daddy, a former all-star. He features a four-seam fastball, a cutter, and he works in a slider. Righty delivers. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. And a strikeout for the first out here in the ninth. Now batting Tristan Casas. He's already homered here in this one. To the right side. Albies. Throws the first. Two up, two down. Good slider inside right there. Batter fighting to get there. Just rolled over it. Got the ground ball. So two down now. And here is Carson Taylor. He's already homered in this game. And first offering is fouled off. Hey, two, out. two outs. Foul ball. The pitch. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. And it's a three up, three down inning. Phillies down in order, but they lead it 9 3. Our final line score tonight, first for the victorious Philadelphia Phillies. Come in, John Chambi, Chris Singleton. Late now stages of this one. Three. Nobody out in the ninth. Number 11. And now for the Marlins, Nassim Nunez. Now, Boog, this is a real tough place for visiting teams to come in and close out ball games for a win. Next offering is in for a strike. This one in the air. Velasco in position. Makes the catch for the out. Well, such a confidence boost for a reliever to come into the ball game and get the first hitter he faces. Just makes everything slow down a little bit. And then from there can really settle in. Harris after it. Puts it away for the out. Well, those can be pretty fun as an outfielder. Got to put it into his highest gear and go a long way to track that one down. Nothing better than that. You feel like a wide receiver playing football. Looking to get the tying run on base. And that one fouled off. 
just missed. If he's able to connect on that, look out. To the right side, Albies on the first ball game. And the Braves hold on to win a tight one as this one ends as a one-run ball game. Nice work out of the bullpen for that first MLB win, Boog. They turned to him when they didn't have the lead. He oh, kept things steady, one. and he's... Welcome in, John Chambi, Chris Singleton. Late stages of this one, nobody out in the ninth. So digging in, Luis Angel Acuna. That clips the corner. Looks like the weather could actually play a factor in this one. It's coming down pretty good. Yeah, it is, and it's not too bad yet. Strike three. Oh, that right there is what you want to see out of your closer. Come in and close the door. Cancel any hope that that opponent has in making some type of comeback in the ball game. Tell you what, that helps him settle in, and that helps everybody else relax a little bit to get these other two outs. Looking to get the tying run on base. Fights that one away, and the count remains 0-2. Down, base is empty. Gets a piece, and it stays 0-2. Got him looking. That's a strikeout. This is definitely what a team likes to see out of their flows. Who come in and just destroy all hope. First two batters, two strikeouts. See if he can strike out the side. So it's their last chance in this one. Rob Chaney getting ready to hit. There's a swing and a miss. This is the type of hitter his club wants it to play, especially playing from behind. He's hoping to start a rally right here. The Nets down to their final strike. Field two. Foul off the plate. They'll do it again. Strike three, got him swinging. And that is the ball game. This is a huge win to take this series on the road before heading back home. You go home feeling good about yourselves. You've got some good... In. John Chambi, Chris Singleton, late stages of this one, nobody out in the ninth. And now for the Twins, Josh Crouch. For the Twins, the catcher. Little bouncer out in front of the plate. Throws the first, and they get the leadoff man in the ninth. Now it's the DH, Jonathan Classe. That one fouled off. Big Daddy, multi-time all-star. He features a four-seam fastball. A cutter, and he works in a slider. Caught him looking for the K. No, that's not the best two-strike fastball I've seen, but certainly got away with the location there. You know, sometimes as a hitter, when you're down in the count, you're so focused on a pitcher painting the black, and you just get a little bit locked up on something down the heart of the plate, not expecting it, and it just kind of freezes you. Big Daddy is just one strike away. And a swing and a miss, and that is the ball game. The final line for our ball game for the victorious Atlanta.
welcome in John Shami, Chris Singleton. Late stages of this one. Nobody out in the ninth. Now it's the Dodger leadoff hitter. Maybe expecting a bunt here. Third baseman playing in on the edge of the grass. Foul back our way, and that's out of play. It's good speed at the top of the order here. You want to get it on, see if you can get a start on base, maybe get around the bases and pick up a run. Definitely got the hitter conscious of the pitch inside. Really think the outer half is open. Swing and a miss, and he struck him out. And a strikeout for the first out here in the ninth. Well, oh, that right there is what you want to see out of your closer. Come in and close the door. Cancel any hope that that opponent has in making some type of comeback in the ball game. I'll tell you what, that helps him settle in, and that helps everybody else relax a little bit to get these other two outs. One and two. Just amazing to me how many closers and back end relievers just triple digits on that last pitch. Well, it's kind of tough right here. A closer comes in and he strikes out the first two hitters. It's hard not to feel defeated and that this is going to go quickly. But you got to go up there, maybe try to find a way to choke up on the bat, spread out, put the ball in play, and maybe you can extend this inning. So it's their last chance in this one. Ryan Jeffers now at the plate. Swings through that one for strike one. 0 oh 1. One strike away. Got it. And that wraps it up for this afternoon. Well, this was a tightly played game. Got a little of everything. Some timely hitting, runs on the board. Key pitching and defense in certain spots. Definitely. Come in, John Chambi, Chris Singleton. Late stages of this one. Nobody out in the ninth. Here's Aloy Jimenez. Aloy Jimenez. They hope he's the guy to spark a comeback. He tends to play better when his team is behind, so why not him? And that's outside. And that's ball one. And that one hit 97 on the gun. And a good eye there. It's a good take. Got him swinging. Well, that right there is what you want to see out of your closer. Come in and close the door. Cancel any hope that that opponent has in making some type of comeback in the ball game. Tell you what, that helps him settle in, and that helps everybody else relax a little bit to get these other two outs. And they're down to their last out. This is definitely what a team likes to yeah. see out of their closer. Come in and just destroy all home. First two batters, two strikeouts. See if he can strike out the side. Paguero stands in now and watches strike one. They're down to their final strike. This could end it. That's off the mark. It's a ball in two strikes. Two down, nobody on. And a swing and a miss. And that is the ball game. After four wins in a row, you start to think a little bit that you're on a roll, and that's the momentum that just takes on a life of its own. Players start hitting up and down the lineup. You never know who's going to come up with the big hit.
Welcome in, John Chambi, Chris Singleton. Late stages of this one. Nobody out in the ninth. And here is Ray Marquez. Swing and a miss as he was late that time. Big Daddy, multi-time all-star. He features a four-seam fastball, a cutter, and he works in a slider. Kicks and fires. Gets a piece, and it stays 0-2. And a strikeout for the first out here in the ninth. Well, that right there is what you want to see out of your closer. Come in and close the door. Cancel any hope that that opponent has in making some type of comeback in the ball game. I'll tell you what, that helps him settle in, and that helps everybody else relax a little bit to get these other two outs. Gets a piece. And stays alive. Little Tony on that fastball is going to have to get it going a little quicker. Get that front foot down. Just missed. It's a good take. And the right hander deals. And a swing and a miss. And they're down to their last out. Well, it's kind of tough right here. Closer comes in and he strikes out the first two hitters. It's hard not to feel defeated and that this is going to go quickly. But you got to go up there, maybe try to find a way to choke up on the bat, spread out, put the ball in play, and maybe you can extend this inning. This could end it. And a swing and a miss, and that is the ball game. Right on the last day of the month, you close it out with the W, but you want to carry that momentum into the next game. The final line for our ball game. For the Welcome in, John Shambi, Chris Singleton. Late stages of this one. Nobody out in the ninth. So digging in now for San Diego, Vaughn Grissom. And first offering is fouled off. Big Daddy, a righty that throws with power. 25 years old, and he was selected to the All-Star game last year. Fights that one away, and the count remains 0-2. Kicks and deals. And that just misses. Really close pitch down around the knees there, and you could see him asking where it missed. Probably doesn't agree, but it appears he's ready to move on to the next pitch. Well, the first batter, it's always a big one for the closer. I mean, you get that punch out, you get settled in, you feel like you're in command out there on the mound from the jump, and kind of prevents any doubt from creeping into your mind or the fielders that are playing behind you that, you know, you're going to wrap this thing up. And he grounds one to the right side. Oh, can't pick it up cleanly. Throw to first. Gets him. Good job to stay with it there for the second half. A couple of pitches and a quick out. So they're down to their final out. Now it's going to be Ethan Salas. First pitch misses. Late with the swing there. Well, so many hard-throwing relievers in the game these days, you would think that hitters have made the adjustment, but I don't know if you ever get used to it. Just pumping gas out of the bullpen. So hard to play catch-up. Foul ball still a one and two count. Big Daddy is just one strike away. Foul ball left side. He'll see another. Also really good at bat. What I like about this guy, his bat stays up. right through there. Got him. That's the ball game.
your attention. Welcome in, John Chambi, Chris Singleton. Late stages of this one. Nobody out in the ninth. Colin Howe up now for the Mets. Right through there for a strike. Big Daddy, a former All-Star. He features a four-seam fastball, a cutter, and he works in a slider. The 0-2. Keeps the at-bat going with a foul ball. And the pitch. Got it. And the leadoff man retired here in the ninth. Well, the first batter, it's always a big one for no, the like closer. You. I mean, you get that punch out, you get settled yeah, in, you feel like you're in command out there on the mound from the jump, and kind of prevents any doubt yeah. from creeping into your mind or the fielders that are Only playing one. behind you that, you know, you're going to wrap this thing up. And that one is lifted in the air. Albies under it. And he makes the catch. Out. Number two. Now that's a tough play for the infielder ranging back Number into the outfield. One. There's part of him that's saying, hey, where are you at, Good. outfielder? Call me on. But he stayed focused and made a nice right. catch right there. Yeah. They're down to their final strike. Just amazing okay. to me how many closers and back end relievers just throw abs. Sends it to center, and that's going to do it. He's got it. Ball game. And the Braves claim the win here behind some great pitching and defense. Another outing, another save. That's his 20th of the season, and this was a good example of why they rely on him so heavily the in these close games. For our ball game. for the big Come in, John Shambi, Chris Singleton. Late stages of this one. Nobody out in the ninth. And now it's Kiebert Ruiz. 0 for 3 with three ground outs. That's in there. It's 0-1. Big Daddy, a former All-Star. He features a four-seam fastball, a cutter, and he works in a slider. And there's a fly ball deep right field. Tavares going back on this one. Pulls it in on the warning track. Man, I love that route. The ball was smoked. He knew he had to get back to the track right away. Turned his back on the infield. Got to the spot. Turned around and made a nice catch. McCann in the box now. No balls and a strike. This one in the air on his way over. And it's the pitcher that makes the play. That's out number two. So it's their last chance in this one. George Chassin, the next up for the Marlins. Oh, one's the count. Two down, nobody on. Swing and a foul over the screen and back out of play. 2013 in the playoffs. You caught one as the Red Sox played the Rays in the division series. I sacrificed a bracelet. It was my wrist and my head. And a swing and a miss. And that is the ball game. Welcome in, John Chambi, Chris Singleton. Late stages of this one, nobody out in the ninth. Here's the catcher, Frank Harris. On the ground to short. Over to first. And they get the leadoff man in the ninth. He's two outs away. Oscar Ornelas, the next to hit. And first offering is fouled off. Big Daddy, a former All-Star. He features a four-seam fastball, a cutter, and he works in a slider. The Nationals trailing by two here in game one of this three-game set. In the air right field. He makes the catch, and there's two down. Maybe caught that one off the end just a little bit. Couldn't quite barrel it up enough to really drive it. 
bag. In the box now. No balls and a strike. Two outs, bases empty. Right through there for a strike. Man, 91 on the slider right there. That's a hard one. That's a low and fastball for some pitchers. Now, that's the ball game. After four wins in a row, you start to think a little bit that you're on a roll. And that's the momentum that just takes on a life of its own. Players start hitting up and down the lineup. More to know who's going to come up with the big win. Welcome in, John Chambi, Chris Singleton. Late stages of this one. Nobody out in the ninth. Luis Angel Acuna digging in for the Nationals. That's a strike. It's 0-1. 0-1. Right on that fastball. I think he was sitting okay. off speed there. Looking to get the tying run on base. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. And a strikeout for the first out here in the ninth. Well, that right there is what you want to see out of your closer. Come in and close the door. Cancel any hope that that opponent has in making some type of comeback in the ball game. Tell you what, that helps him settle in. And that helps everybody else relax a little bit to get these other two outs. And a pitch. That ball is foul, and the pressure is building. The 0-2. Now this is in the air down the line. And that lands in no man's land, a foul ball. One down, base is empty. Good job to fight that one off. Just no, missed. And that's awfully close. I don't know how you take that. He's seeing the ball out of the pitcher's hand really well right now. This one popped up. Foul ground, first base side. Falls it in for the end. Last chance for the Nats in this one. Oscar Ornelas. And there's a foul ball. Big Daddy, 25 years old, and he was a third-round pick in 2023. The Nets down to their final strike. Got him, and that's the ball game. When you win five in a row, the confidence just goes to another level, and you start to gain this momentum, and you think that you're never going to lose a game again because things are clicking up and down the line. How the pitchers are pitching. Welcome in, John Chami, Chris Singleton. Late stages of this one. Nobody out in the ninth. And now up for Washington, Luis Angel Acuna. Three ground outs already. He's over three. First pitch swinging. Big Daddy, an all star a season ago. He features a four seam fastball, a cutter, and he works in a slider. And a swing and a miss. And a strikeout for the first out here in the ninth. Well, that right there is what you want to see out of your closer. Come in and close the door. Cancel any hope that that opponent has in making some type of comeback in the ball game. Tell you what, that helps him settle in, and that helps everybody else relax a little bit to get these other two outs. Goes down looking. This is definitely what a team likes to see out of their closer. Come in and just destroy all hope. First two batters, two strikeouts. See if he can strike out the side. So they're down to their final out. Oscar Ornelas digging in for the Nationals. Hey, seven straight strikes to start the frame. He's got a chance at an immaculate inning. Well, they've kept him pretty quiet in this series. Still doesn't have a knock. I know you want to get that. On the ground, and this should do it. On the first, ball game. And the Braves claim the win here behind some great pitching and defense. Ball with his sixth win in a row, all of a sudden, you start to look around. Welcome in, John Chambi, Chris now Singleton. Late lineup. stages of this one, Number nobody 11. out in the ninth. The Alec athletic. Thomas now. The designated hitter. Alec Thomas. Hey, no outs now. Found back our way, and that's out of play. 2013 in the playoffs, you caught one. As the Red Sox played the Rays in the division series. 
I sacrificed a bracelet. It was my wrist and my hand. Struck him out swinging. Some high cheese for strike three. Well, the first batter, it's always a big one for the closer. I mean, you get that punch out, you get settled in, you feel like you're in command out there on the mound from the jump, and kind of prevents any doubt from creeping into your mind or the fielders that are playing behind you that, you know, you're going to wrap this thing up. Righty delivers. Now one and one. They hope he's the guy to spark a comeback. He tends to play better when his team is behind, so why not him? Cuts and misses. It's a strikeout. Now it's kind of tough right here. Closer comes in and he strikes out the first two hitters. It's hard not to feel defeat. He swings and fouls one off. Two outs. Foul ball. Big Daddy is just one strike away. Got him. And that'll do it. It's always nice to grab the opener of a series. You come into a new ballpark, and just sometimes things aren't as comfortable as what you've been used to. The mound doesn't look straight. The background isn't what you like, but they didn't let any of those things. Welcome in, John Chami, Chris Singleton. Late stages of this one. Nobody out in the ninth. Here's Jared Kelman. Swing and a foul back. That's out of play. Big Daddy, a former All-Star, 25 years old, and he was a third-round pick in 2023. And he deals. Foul ball still 0-2. Swings and misses. Struck him out. Well, that right there is what you want to see out of your closer. Come in and close the door. Cancel any hope that that opponent has in making some type of comeback in the ball game. Tell you what, that helps him settle in, and that helps everybody else relax a little bit to get these other two outs. One out, base is empty. Swing and a miss. Got him to go up the ladder for the K. This is definitely what a team likes to see out of their closer. Now Come that. in and Why just destroy all of them. First two batters, two strikeouts. Oh, yeah. Let's see if he can strike out the side. Baez at one the strike. plate with two away. Swings through that one. Swing and a miss. And it's not again two. This could end it. Got him. And that is the ball game. And John Chambi, Chris Singleton, late stages of this one, nobody out in the ninth. So digging in, Jack Sawinski. The center fielder. This one in the air. Wind has a beat on it. Hauls it in for the out. Yeah, I'm looking at his body language, and he just now doesn't battle. seem like things no are in sync. And the ball's just not Warren. coming off his bath the way it did earlier in the regular Cruz. season. And He's two outs away. Right and now, yeah. Brian De La Cruz. Base is empty one away here in the third and final game of the series. Swings through that one for strike two. Swing and a miss. And he's down on strikes. And they're down to their last out. So they're down to their final out. Now, here it. And first offering is fouled off. Well, no base hits in the series for him so far, and it's clearly been a rough well, one. You just hope he's not pressing too hard because that just compounds things and makes the slump even longer. Never seems to help. Never helped me. The Pirates down to their final strike. Fouls it back with two strikes. Two down, nobody on. Got him. And that'll do it. Well, the goal when you.